Hey, how's it going? This is a quick guide on how to do one tick box trap hunter. This method does require at least one way to three ticks, so I chose a knife and teak and mahogany logs, so that way I have a second chance in case I screw up the first one. To perform this method, we first need to understand that this has two parts to it, so starting the actual cycle and then the loop that you'll be performing repeatedly. So to start the cycle, you'll begin by taking a trap. So this can be a setup trap that is empty, a fail trap, or a trap with a chin chomp in it. Once you have completed that animation, you will start your three tick cycle by using the knife on the logs or whatever else method you have. Then you will move or wait for one tick. At this part, we enter the looping portion of the method. Uh, to do the looping portion, we will place the trap and in the same tick, move to the next tile. So it's standing on top of your next box trap. And then following that, we will take the trap. And once the animation for taking the trap is complete, we will immediately place another box trap and move to the next box trap. So once more to summarize, on your first tick, you will take a trap. On your second tick, you will start your three tick. On your third tick, you will move or wait for one tick. On your fourth tick, you will place a trap and also move to stand on top of your next box trap. On your fifth tick, you will take that box trap. And then repeat, six and seven, you will place the trap and move and take the trap. Eight and nine, place the trap and move, take the trap, and so on and so forth. This covers the basics of performing this method. There is amplifying information out there in case you have five box traps or you're looking for other layouts for this. Some tips for this. If you click past your trap when you're doing the running part, you won't accidentally click on your trap and disassemble it and ruining your cycle. I'd also recommend using a true top plugin to see where you're at, which helps you with your timing. And lastly, I would recommend to practice this a little bit with empty traps where you go and start setting it up because these chin chompas will run into your traps and mess up your cycle uh, with the animation of them being caught. Good luck and happy hunting.